we look at nano devices that can be utilized for healthcare, environment monitoring, personal electronics. How do you power these devices is a critical issue. By virtue of piezoelectric one-dimensional nanowires, we've been able to fabricate nano generators which can convert tiny mechanical disturbance into electricity. Most recently, we successfully boosted up the electric output of the nano generator by integrating a large number of nanowires together so that they can work in a simultaneous manner. 1999, 11 years ago, I started with zinc oxide. We were the first group in the world to do this research. We use this material as a raw material, then we make a nano structure out of it. So we call nano wires. That means tiny little wires have a diameter of 100 to 300 nanometer, have a length of about 10 to 100 micron. Let me give you the idea how long is 100 micron. 100 micron is two hair width. In our lab, we do from beginning to end. From beginning, we have material synthesis. This includes physical vapor deposition, chemical synthesis. Then to device fabrication, to structure analysis, to measurements, to packaging, we try to cover the whole thing. Using the nano generator as a power source, we successfully demonstrated powering conventional electronics, such light emitting diode, laser diode, and the liquid crystal display. This is a major step that is likely to bring nanogenerator-based self-power technology into people's daily life. We talk about tiny physical motion, your heart beating, uh, your muscle movement. We call irregular motion. That's what we target at. We want to harvest irregular energy, irregular motion induced energy into electricity. We use nanomaterials to do that. From beginning to today, we improve the power output billions of times. And that's with, we've done that within the last five years. This is just a start. As we can drive this small component, we can drive small systems in the near future. So we came a long way, but step by step from science to engineering to technology, and we hopefully to do commercialization in the next few years.